another video so soon. I've been recording like crazy lately, huh? So um, I just wanted to talk about something that I talked about a little bit in one of my last couple of videos and um, that is sabotage. I think I am sabotaging myself without intentionally doing it. So here's why I think that. So I've been at the same weight for the past month or so, about 214, and um, I've been going to Zumba three to four times a week if I can based on holidays and all that stuff. We've had a couple Monday holidays that I haven't been able to go. Um, but other than that, I go, I try and go Monday through Thursday. Now I don't work out on the weekends, um, and I don't watch what I eat on the weekends really. Um, not that I go crazy, but I just kind of watch more during the week. So um, here's my thing. I've said it before and I'm almost scared of doing too well because if I start to do really well and I start to lose weight then what happens when I start to gain weight or what happens if I if I don't follow like a strict routine like I was when I was losing weight you know what I mean like right now up until this point with my lap in journey the past year and a half I have not been very strict with myself and um, I've been sort of eating within reason you know what I want to eat um, a lot of changes don't get me wrong I've made a lot of changes I don't eat breads and pasta and things like that but I still eat nachos every night for dinner I have sweet potato chips I put avocado black beans lots of cheese sometimes it's low fat cheese sometimes it's not I use like a quarter of an avocado which is a lot of fat um, I still am eating my sweet potato chips and um, you know I just sometimes I still go down to get donuts like I, I I'm not I don't I wouldn't say that I eat really well so I'm just afraid and I'm terrified and it sounds really silly but I'm terrified to start eating really well and to start going like crazy exercising like I want to and then losing all this weight and then stopping that because I, it's not like realistic for the rest of my life to work out you know five days a week or six days a week you know I have a kid I'm a single mom I mean maybe it is realistic I don't know people do it right it's just not what I've been doing so I'm just afraid to lose the weight because then I'm afraid to gain it back if I stop you know and um, I don't know it's just like that's such a silly way to think do other people think like that like are you guys scared of that too you know I'm, I, I want to like lose the weight and keep it off forever so I figure okay if I'm doing it slowly then um, I'll keep it off you know and um, if I make small changes and all that but I'm like I'm ready for the next step you know like I um, I tried boot camp last night for the first time in a year and last time I could not walk for two weeks I remember making a video that my quads were broken and people were like oh no you're okay just walk like I remember um, being to Jen or um, Jen Knopp I think it's a Jen cop Jen Knopp sorry I'm butchering your name but Jen and Brad they were um, she was like you know oh no just make sure you walk around I just remember I was in such such pain and I was like I'm never doing this again and I did it last night and um, I didn't go crazy crazy because I was afraid I wouldn't be able to work out you know after and the next few days or whatever so but I still worked out really hard and I was able to do it and I'm sore today and like it hurts to blow my nose like who knew you use ab muscles to blow your nose well you do but I'm still going to Zumba tonight and I'm not like incapacitated like I was last time so um, I'm ready I'm ready to start going to boot camp I've been thinking of incorporating more um, toning into my routine I have the cardio down and now I want to get more toning and more toned more fit I want to tighten that shit up as the boot camp is titled so um, yeah, I think I just realized that I've sort of been sabotaging myself and, and not restricting myself and being like, yeah, that's fine, you want it, eat it, you know? And um, I remember talking about in one of my videos that, you know, just because you want something doesn't mean you have to have it. You know, if I'm craving it, like wait a little while. If you're still craving it later or the next day, then get it. But if it goes away, then, you know, forget about it. It's like, who cares? So. I don't know, I'm just um, sort of realizing that I've been sabotaging myself a little bit and um, and I think I'm just afraid and, and I, I shouldn't be afraid and I, you know, I wanna go get my Zumba instructor license. I think I talked about that also. And um, like just the thought of that just elates me. I'm so excited about it and I picture like opening my own gym and you know going to teach Zumba to people and telling them my story and like I weigh 321 pounds and if I can do it, you can do it. And you know, I feel, I'm, I feel like I wanna motivate people and help them and so my goal for this week is to just go all out and see what happens and just you know restrict myself as much as I can without feeling like I'm on a diet and to work out as much as I can and do go the extra mile and push myself 
and not worry about what happens if I gain the weight back. Um, so I think that's like a big epiphany for me in, in kind of realizing the whole mental part of this, that I'm, I'm sort of blocking myself from, from going down because then if I hit my goal weight, then what? You know, then what? Then I have to maintain, you know, and I don't know. It's just, it's so scary, you know? So anyway, I have goals. I'm going to get there. I'm going to push myself and not be afraid of the unknown because I can't be afraid of losing weight just in case I, I gain it back. Like I haven't even lost it yet. How do I know I'm going to gain it back? You know, so that's just a silly way of thinking. I think it's pretty common though. So, um, comment below if you have any thoughts, but, um, I did my measurements this month, I do them every month, and I've lost about three and a half in my waist. Everything else was like the same, and my weight was the exact same. Um, so yeah, uh, that's my update for now, and I'll update soon. Bye.